Okay, the first thing you gotta know about casting when it comes to certain apps like Disney Plus is you need a Google Chromecast or a TV that's compatible that you can cast to your TV. These things are amazing because the essence is that smart TVs go extinct. These Chromecasts can cast a lot of the things. Amazon Prime, uh, YouTube, they can cast Netflix, all these things. And you don't even need a smart TV. So you can get an older TV, get one of these devices and plug it into your TV, then connect and then you can cast. So let's go through the thing and then I'll show you how to cast from your cell phone and tablet. First things first, you connect the power to this Chromecast, which you plug it in and it's attached. And then you gotta plug this HDMI cable into one of your HDMI ports on the back. And you only have so many available. So plug this in when this is, Chromecast is powered on and we'll go from there. First thing, go to the input on your device and you can check to see and switch over to the Chromecast. So let's go through, I don't know if it's a two or a three, just go through and then you'll find out which one is actually connected. So it must be a one and here we go, boom, okay. So now you can see that this download and open the Google Home app. So you have to install the Google Home app and then put the, co you have to go to, um, to the, put the uh, connect to with your Wi-Fi to that code in the bottom right here and a Chromecast and a number I have added to blur out because it's mine and then we go we do that so let's go ahead and do that and set up this Chromecast so you got to connect to your mobile device your cell phone in the Google Home app so open the Google Home app I'm on my iPhone this could be your Android either also you got to install this Google Home app see in the top here it's also beneficial to install the Google Home Assistant also just do that but if you go into Google Home app that you, you've been told to on the screen because you plugged the Google Chrome device in. Now, when you're in here, you see the set, you see the settings here in the top area. Now, I've got a lot of different areas open here that it's um, about my smart home. Click the gear right here, and if you scroll down, you'll see that there's a um, add a new device right there, add. So add that, and now you have to do a set up a new device. So go ahead and click set up and set up a new device, okay? And now, and where's the home? So you'll see your home that has been set up. You go next and turn on Bluetooth. Um, so you have to do that. I guess I didn't have that on, I should have. Would have made things easier. Uh, boom, and now it's looking. And it'll keep looking. This is funny, because it does take a bit for it to look. Uh, it surprises me, it takes, but it has to go through your Wi-Fi. It's looking around your network. Now, it's, I guess it's looking for the Chromecast that you plugged into your TV, and boom, there it is with the correct number. So I'm gonna click on it right now, and I'm gonna record my screen also on my um, TV so you can see what's going on at the same time. I'll go next, and now it's connecting, and on the TV, it says follow the instructions. Um, and now it's trying to connect through my cell phone to my TV. Now, it's, it gave a code. There's the code, and, and it just confirm that it's the right code, and you say yes, and now it get, goes, you know, you want to improve, sure. Give, give all your data to Google, sure, why not? Now, where is this device? Put it where it is. Um, I know where it is in mine. I've got a smart home set up, and I'm just making it more and more connected, and I know where my, what my um, Wi-Fi is. I'm gonna to connect to the proper Wi-Fi, because it all, you have to connect to your Wi-Fi, um, so you should be already attached to that on your cell phone device and all of it syncs. So essentially your cell phone is becoming a casting device, a controller that can control and throw things to your TV. And that's really what's going on. It'll reset your TV, it'll update the TV and the firmware on the Chromecast while you're, you're actually setting things up on your phone and it'll slowly um, update both. And it'll go through this process and then, then you'll be able to control things from your cell phone in various rooms. Say the kids are downstairs watching TV. You can shut it off, <laughs> you know. But the real thing is that you'll be able to cast Disney Plus from the Disney Plus app or the Amazon Prime Video or the Netflix from your phone and send it over to your smart T or your non-smart TV that is smart because you plugged in a Chromecast. Chromecast is an add-on to your TV to make it smart. It was like... Given, you know, it was put into the market before smart TVs to make non-smart TVs smart. And honestly, they're, they're better peripheral these days than the other. I wish I could just continue to buy really good um, TVs that don't have the smart technology that gets outdated and just keep plugging this th thing in. Because throwing it is what it's all about. So now it says linking your Chromecast. And I go continue. And the TV is doing its own thing. And this is real time. 
and um, I'm gonna go stay. I don't need to have done this many times, so I'm just gonna say no thanks for now. My TV's restarting, and my app on my phone is getting going. And really, I'm just gonna show you that once this is all saying almost done, here's a review of what you've done. Device uh, is to where it is in my T, my room, services that are available, and it's connected to the right Wi-Fi. And I'm like, yes, it is. And so now on my TV, my Chromecast is updating and you'll see that on your TV, just like you do here in this video. And uh, it'll continue to do that. And it's all about update. Firmware means this. Firmware is like a little memory chip on whatever device you have. It gets updated and companies that support your devices update things on your devices here and there from your PS3 to your, um, I mean like even audio equipment to your Chromecast, to your TV needs to be updated when you first buy it. A lot of devices and through the internet, the internet can update your devices and that's what the firmware is being updated. So in whatever date you are now, it will give you the most updated version of the software so that it can send the signal and receive the casting. So on your phone, you see this and on your TV, it should be updating and the Chromecast should be beginning. I've already installed the Disney app. So once this is ready, I'm now gonna show you what it's like to send something from my cell phone, which could still cast from my tablet. Both a tablet and a cell phone is a mobile device, just to let you know, they're both mobile devices. And they both have the apps that scale on those peripherals, those devices, and then you can simply click the cast button when you want to and send it. So here we go, almost done. And look at that, finishing uh, setup in your home app, then get to know, so that's pretty awesome. And it's, you know, it gives like this three to four minutes thing, and sure, why not? Um, exit setup, resume, so there it is. Choose a sample clip. I don't need this. So this is going to say, I'm going to just skip the tutorial because the tutorial is there, but finish the tutorial. Now it's set up. So now I'm going to go back to my apps and I'm going to go find my Disney app. Okay. And I think I installed it. <laughs> yeah, there it is. And there it is. So I go in, it's just kind of like a Netflix app and um, I'm going to go in and it's going to start up. There's a seven day free trial, by the way. I wish it was 30, but Disney's really awesome and you got to give it a try any time of the year. So let's log in and I'm going to log in and we're going to go and do, 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 do. And we're continuing. Don't need to show. And then I'm going to log in with my password on my cell phone. And then, well, you can choose different profiles. I like different profiles. So I'm going to log into um, mine. And I'm gonna go in, and then I'm gonna go to watch. Let's start with Disney Togo. So cool, a man and his dog. It's like me and my dog. I love my dog. Mika's so beautiful. And then I'm gonna go play. Okay, so first off, see in the top right here, see this little cast icon? That's the casting icon. So I can click on that. You can click on that stream too, and then select the living room TV, and boom, this is what's showing up on my TV now. Um, it's interesting, it's kind of like a half bar, but it's now connecting that Disney's coming from my phone to the Chromecast on my TV and, and now it's ready. So if I click play on my phone right now, right here, click it, boom, it should throw it to my TV. Go get the popcorn, chips, healthy snacks, and enjoy yourself. And here we go. Oh, look at that, guys. Absolutely beautiful. Oh, let's turn the music up. Yep, there it is. Absolutely wonderful. Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed this uh, tutorial. And if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments below and I'll help you to learn how to cast Disney Plus uh, movies, streaming movies, TV shows to your TV through using a Chromecast. Have a great day and I'll see you in another video.